Hey everyone, welcome back to Monster Seed. Last time, Boss Fortress, the Town Plaza, Carl's House, and this time is Jeed's Mine. And, uh, I'm gonna apologize for any, like, audio issues or anything else, uh, slow down or anything else on my end because my computer sucks. Um, I'm trying. And uh, here is something. The trolley station. It'd be easier to move around inside the mine if there was a trolley. Yes, it would. Nothing else there. You don't even need to go that way. Um, the way you need to go is this way. Just wandering this way. Keep going and... Just keep going. There's a rat up there. You can get that if you jump off a trolley. Or a minecart. Once again, you can get that if you jump off a minecart. Um, rats you can't catch. You can't really interact with anything. You need to have treasure chests to open them. And find stuff. And uh, that's... A tank engine sound. Great. I can hear it over my own headset. That way's an encounter and nothing. Uh, so let's go this way. What an enormous pot. Oh, sorry. What an enormous pot! I wonder what's inside. I wonder if there's anything in it. Should there be? Oh, you are useless. Uh, that's gonna get annoying, especially while I'm recording. Yes, my niece is over and she is playing with a loud Thomas the Tank Engine toy. Hooray. What a joy to be an uncle at this moment. Nothing in that room. But you have to check every room, don't you? It's kind of a rule, gaming. Gotta check everything. <sighs> Once again, a pot and nothing else. Okay. Then let's go down. And down is an encounter. Okay! This time it gets me, uh, gives me reason to summon Zork. And pals. She had to turn it on, didn't she? Alright, there's Zork. Uh, let's see. Let's summon... Let's summon the Feral Imp in attack mode. Um... Yeah, I'm a geek. It's okay. Call... Yeah, let's call Tepig. Right there. And, uh... Stand by. Goo gas. Okay. You really can do it, can't you? Well, at least it's not attacking me. Sork, I want you to... Hello? Just kill these motherfuckers, will ya? Who's that crazy cook destroying the world, did Sork? 
It's Orkin Pals. Now I need you to move out of my way so I can do things. Yeah, no, this is an encounter without a ruler, so... Ten point! Elders? You're old? Okay. Weep it! Should be well. Never mind. Especially if he takes care of this one, I'm not gonna mind. Let's have it die, and it almost did. Yay! And it's mad. I'm moving out of there to try and give Zork a way out. Feral Imp. And he's gonna try and finish it off too. Ella Pink. Man, you did a horrible job. Gold Targas, once again. And I have no problems with this, actually. Because it kills it. MP reaches zero, and it's dead. Okay. <laughs> you lasted the longest out of all of your compatriots. Hey, I got a seed! As with last time, we'll be doing the hatching after all of the uh, things are done. I need dynamite. Somehow we've got to find out how to get inside. Maybe not. We can't get inside like this, can we? It would take just one blast if we had some dynamite. Yeah, this is one of those games that I'm playing just because... Uh... What? What? This end... Locked up. Such a hassle. If only there was some dynamite. There is. Oh, there is. Uh, no, not gonna go that way. What I am gonna do is travel back just a little bit. And, uh, go up in that, in that place where I sh didn't. Minecart! Um, we'll be taking this in a little bit, just to, uh, go back and check those chests, but right now, um, we'll be going this way. This is the way we're supposed to go, so I'll have a bunch of time to get what's in those chests. And, yeah, let's go this way. Trolley station, again. And, uh, let's go over here. And this way. This is the way we're really supposed to go. And, uh, we're trying to find dynamite. Sometimes it's easier than going downstairs just to fall because you don't take fall damage. I want it! Okay. Alright. Uh, 
da 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 Come on. Which way should I go? They used to put soil in this and carry it. Mining work doesn't look e like easy work. Still, I'm a ruler, so it's got nothing to do with me. Prick. I am ashamed that you have my name. Yes, exactly what I was meant to say. Let's see what's in here. Is the dynamite in this chest? Nope. The two solutions. Sound and fist resist. Alright. Let's go this way. Oh, another chest. Dynamite in here. Check the treasure chest and Nelt Rizua with two, uh, I believe those are ice potions. Since I only got one seed so far. Uh, okay, there's the hole that I need to enter. Okay, nothing over here, nothing over there, and time to keep going. Encounter your start. Apparently, Mao is uh, commenting on everything now. Okay, call. Oh, right, right. I can't call anything in that spot because it's the hole. So, what I want to do is back here. Call Aguman over here. Call Flounder because I can. I really like my battling or my harassment types. My harassment types are awesome. Call and this should be something that uh, does something. I like Sand Slash here. Sand Slash is awesome. So, here we go. Stand by. My harassment type is out. I have no idea what a jellyfish is supposed to sound like, so I'm not even going to try. If you guys want to try, please be my guest. Oh yeah, he's a floating type. I forget floating types exist in this game. So easy to forget. I got a better Agumon with Blackjack. Hookers. Yeah, forget it. Come on, Sand Slash. Be amazing. <laughs> Bam! Eat his flesh. Rip it from the bone! Destroy him, Agumon! Oh. 
feast upon his dead co uh, caucus. Yes, I'm afraid I can be just a little bit uh, deranged at times, I suppose. I meant to go to standby, and I keep screwing that up. And yeah, Sand Slash cannot go through. Flounder has his work cut out for him, and he can't attack. Why is he not attacking? Recovery. Yes, that is all for today because you did nothing! Let's go pseudo wudo. Hopefully you summon in fast. Because otherwise you're probably not gonna be uh, there too long. Thank you. Finally. Jesus. Kill the bird! Kill the bird! Come on, Pseudo Wudo! Come on, Pseudo Wudo! Kill the bird! Bird's dead! Thank you, Agumon! Told you, I got a better Agumon! Though, the Blackjack and Hookers didn't really come into play, but I got a better Agumon! <sighs> okay. Sand Slash is moving. Pseudo Wudo cannot move. Aguman. Okay, moving around the other side of the pit. is going to attack Aguman. Luckily, battling defense with him is actually really, really fucking good. Pseudo Wudo! Kill him! Bubbly slide! Rip his arms off, Pseudo Wudo! Eh, fine, just eat him. Spoils of war. I got another seed! Yay! This must be the f where the flower is. Yep. The item merchant will be uh, over the moon to get a hold of this. I keep forgetting that I'm doing the whole uh, voice acting thing, so I apologize for not reading. This must be the Molu. I could go that way, or I could go this way. A big hole goes deep uh, down right to the bottom. We must be careful not to fall. Once we fall, it's the end. Yeah, must be really, really careful not to fall through this invisible wall. Sorry. I have to kind of show off some things like that.
Okay. Just keep going, just keep moving, 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 keep moving, moving along. Metabots! Okay, time to go up and over and up. And this will be the, uh, you know, whenever we get back to town, that'll be the end of this episode. But until then, you're going to have to watch me gather a little bit of treasure. Not much. I'm, gonna, I'm only going to do this, like, one per trip, so. Because this, this is where you spend most of your time in this game, is Jeed's Mine. Jeed's Mine, Ball's Fortress are the two places that you will know, like, the back of your hand. Yeah, I didn't want to jump off for that one. This one, though. I do. Blue necklace. Hey. Remember somebody wanted a blue necklace? Wonder who that could be. Ah, well. It's time to leave the mine. And when we do, we'll get a lot more cutscenes in the next episode. But right now, I think it's time to say goodnight. And so, with that in mind, and Jeed's mind behind us, I am saying goodnight. <laughs>